It's elite. Uh, we get pretty competitive out here, uh, all trying to prove ourselves, um, especially with everyone out here almost ha having an offer. Good evening, everyone. There isn't a high schooler out there that hasn't played in a seven on seven football game, right? Team Full Gorilla, they take it to another level, though. And as News 5 found out, these athletes are playing for a lot more than just respect. <laughs> With more than 100 Division I scholarship offers on this turf field at Highland Heritage Regional Park, this isn't your typical seven-on-seven -seven football game. The competition out here is uh, second to none. Uh, we get all the best athletes out here. Um, it's something you can't do with team practices. Uh, it's just airing it out, getting extra reps in. Um, we're all just out here to work. For the past four years, Team Full Gorilla, a nonprofit startup out of the Denver area, has been providing Colorado's top prep athletes the chance to hone their skills and build a pretty impressive recruiting tape in the process. Very important, um, you know, all the college coaches that offered all these guys out here are able to see, you know, me and everybody else out here. So it gets, it's a lot of exposure for everybody else out here. Rep after rep after rep. If you're not willing to get the extra reps, then you might as well not look past high school football. It's iron sharpening iron from every corner of the state. Oh, nice catch, Kayona. Building lasting bonds as they battle the best from across the U.S. Like this week's upcoming tournament on the national stage in Las Vegas. And you get all the best teams. I mean, you get Deion Sanders teams out there. You get Cam Newton's, Peyton Manning's teams out there. You know, and these guys get to see all that. When they step on the field and fall, and they're like, oh, this is easy. I was just going against so and <laughs> so. So that's, what, that's really fun to watch. An extra layer of excellence for those dreaming of playing long beyond Fridays in the fall. I love it. You know, born and raised Colorado. So, you know, I've always I've been around here for a while. And, you know, all around people like Colorado can't ball. But, you know, if you come to one of these, you'll see that we got some real ballers out here. Best of luck to them this upcoming weekend. All right.